All right, I'm here with Emma and Emily. They're gonna tell us a bit about the uh, cranes and the uh, rotunda. So what inspired you guys to, to do this? Um, right after Catherine died, I was looking for a way to just like cope and um, I guess like something to keep me busy, keep me occupied. And I remembered how in fifth grade, Catherine and Emma and I and some and Nana and some other people um, randomly decided to try to fold a thousand cranes and we never, it never really got off the ground. I think we had like 200 or something when we gave up. And then we lost all of them. And then we lost all of them. Um, so then when I was a freshman, right after Catherine died, I decided that starting to do that would like, and if we did actually get to a thousand would be a nice way to come full circle as well as create a really nice tribute to her. All right, so uh, tell us a bit about the process of making all these cranes. Uh, I started folding cranes in like three days after Catherine died, so March of 2014. And then throughout that year and um, over the summer and into the next school year, Emma and Netta also started folding cranes with me. And um, I think by February of the following year, we had gotten to a thousand. And we spent some time after school um, with Mr. McWilliams' help and Mr. Smith, the counselor, um, stringing them onto fishing line and then organizing them by color and hanging them up in the rotunda. All right, so how have you guys seen this uh, project impact the school and uh, her friends? Um, well, I think that we would hope for the display to have a positive impact. I've heard a lot of people say that they like how colorful it is and how pretty it is, and we've kept it up for a long time, starting in like around March, around this time. Um, and I think that we would like for it to stand as an example to students who might be struggling with depression or mental illness that there are tons of people here at Talawanda who understand you and are willing to help you. Um, and hopefully people can just understand that this is a really positive thing that we do and there are lots of people out there who love and support you. I also think that it's a nice way to remember Catherine around this time every year.